Today we're gonna take a look at an add-on called JMO Graph Nodes. The Geometry Nodes project allows you to make object clones very quickly and easily inside Blender. Similar to Cinema 4D's MoGraph system, this tool attempts to create a similar workflow in Blender. Using different combinations of JMO Graph geometry nodes, you can achieve extremely intricate and highly customizable effects. You can create cloner, fracture motion, mapping image color to instance, etc. In no time using this geometry node kit, you can create effects like fracture, laser scans, mapping colors, morphing, and so much more. Created by Chinese artist Zhang Ji, the Geometry Node project comes with multiple node groups that you can use to create different effects. For example, the Cloner Node group allows you to clone and duplicate your objects or any other collection you want. You have four cloner modes where each of them provides different controls to suit your use case. For example, Grid Mode on the other hand is for grid-like structures. There is also the object mode, which you can use for the geometric normal space to define the orientation axis of the instance. And finally, linear mode, which is similar to Cinema 4D's classic linear mode. To control the transformation of the instances, you have effector type nodes. Similar to the cloner nodes, there are different types of effectors to achieve different results. For example, you have random effector, which is, as the name suggests, able to allow you to randomize your instance position, rotation, scale, and so on randomly. There is also the noise text effector, which uses a noise node to affect the values of the instances, and image text, which works in the UV space. For instance, you can use an image to control the transformation of the instances. We also have step and plane effectors that make base movement changes to the instances. Target factors orient instances toward a set object, like a set of arrows pointing in the same trajectory. The field control nodes can control the effect between different states of your object, like changes in color, size, rotation, visibility, density, and so on. These fields can be combined and adjusted with the use of RGB mix, color ramp, RGB curve, etc. For instance, simple field is usually controlled by an empty object and can change its appearance to a sphere or a cube with rounded controls. Node will control the field input by mapping a node texture that you can fully adjust and customize to your heart's content. Furthermore, we have other field types like object and linear, which apply the effect separately on each axis. And in the future, the developer is promising even more content and more Cinema 4D MoGraph features to this node kit and adding even more powerful stuff. Now, the latest 1.04 release added a volume feature for the object mode cloner and improved a lot of nodes performance. JMOGRAPH offers different licenses such as personal, professional, studio, and light licenses with varying amounts of content. The pro version also comes with demo projects to help you get started with the geometry node kit. So this project is extremely promising and maybe in the future, these effects can be embedded in Blender as motion graphic presets. Blender has proven itself more than capable to handle motion graphics projects. And with add-ons such as JMOGRAPH, this is gonna be even easier and better. If you are interested, you will find the necessary links in the description. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.